Welcome back to my flipped classroom. We're talking about economic concepts right now and I want to focus this segment on the four factors of production. So you've decided you have a product and you're ready to go. These four factors will impact your production. The first factor I want to talk about is land. And by land, I mean any natural resource. Anything found in nature that helps to create your product. The land that your factory sits on, the rubber that might go into your product, the oil or the natural gas, all of that is considered a natural resource and a lot of times is lumped under the category of land. So make sure you think about anything in nature when you hear land in relation to factors of production. The next factor of production is labor. They are the people who work for you in any capacity to help you create your product. The sales clerk, the truck driver that moves your product, the factory worker, the guy cutting trees for you to clear the land so that you can put up the factory. Any aspect of work that you can think of falls under the category of labor. The next factor of production is capital, for short. Capital goods, if you want to be very specific. And capital goods are all the items needed to create your product. So anything you use to make something else. The hammer and nails, the building where your factory is, the trucks that transport your product, all capital goods. Finally, and maybe most importantly for the American economy, is entrepreneurship. And that is the will of a person to take a risk and open a business. The American economy was founded on this ideal of the small businessman opening up a business and taking a risk. It's a very important ideal, still used today. People open businesses all the time. Of course, businesses fail all the time, but that doesn't stop them from trying. It is a defining characteristic of the American economy that we have entrepreneurship. Without it, there would be no independently owned businesses. So, to wrap up, the four factors of production are land, natural resources, labor, all the work that goes into the product, capital, the capital goods needed to make the product, and entrepreneurship, the willingness to take a risk. Make sure that you understand these concepts because they are very important to understanding the American economy. Okay, thank you. See you later.